more comments left. Three more comments left. Ladies and gentlemen, please welcome to the stage our next comedian doing his rendition of Lenny Bruce. Please give it up for Dan America! <laughs> see, I like to do that because let's like see if I get a lot of rejection. And if I do, I just assume because there's a lot of Jews out there. <laughs> Don't know what I'm doing and think I'm trying to hit them. Uh, now, stop me if you heard this one before. <laughs> Thank you for not moving in the front row. So I'm going to just run away. Now, that may have been obscene, but uh, you know the meaning of the word obscene? Perhaps you do, but said you don't for argument's sake. Uh, I can get up here and do a disgusting show or use disgusting words, or let's say that I'm gonna talk about pork. See, it's my right as an American citizen to get up here on stage and talk about pork. So all you vegetarians, Jews, and Muslims, that's my right to get up here and talk about ham and pork. And if you communists wanna keep me from that, well, that's your right. Um, but, no, obscenity really has only one meaning, and that's to get you horny. And uh, I'd like an uh, answer from at least some uh, grammar school graduates here. Um, I find the word son of a bitch less offensive than motherfucker. <laughs> if motherfucker gets you sexually stimulated, then you're in trouble. Especially if it's my mother. And titty is dirty, but. Well, a pretty titty is dirty, but if a titty is mangled and bloody, it's not. Other than that, uh, if the human body offends you, then blame the manufacturer. Now something that comes from the human body that's kind of obscene. Uh, but first, two is a proposition, two is a proposition, come as a verb. Two is a proposition, come as a verb, two is a proposition. Come as a verb, the verb intransitive, to come, to come. I've heard those words all my adult life and when I was a kid, while the adults thought I was sleeping. Yeah. It's kind of like a drum solo. To come, to come. To come, to come. Did you come good? Did you come good? Did you come, 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 did you come good? 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 Did you come in me? Don't come in me. Don't come in me, 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 me. Don't come in me, 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 me. Don't come in me, 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 me. Did you come good? Did you come good? Did you come? 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 I can't come. What? You can't come? You don't love me? You can't come? I can't come. You can't come? I'm wasted. I can't come. Now, what the hell does it matter? Because coming has nothing to do with love. Other than that, uh, if those two words offended anyone, uh, is find them to be rank, obscene, or anything to that nature, then it's probably because you can't come. And if you can't come, well, unfortunate for you, because that's the meaning of existence, to come and recreate. <laughs> anyway, I'm Dan America. That was Lenny Bruce. And my real name is actually Dan America Bruce. And just let me say, in defense of Bill Cosby, he always told clean jokes and always had a clean set. So shame on you people. He saved the dirty jokes for when his audience was unconscious. That's awesome. Ladies and gentlemen, our next comedian, 